And we find ourselves in one of the great football cities, Liverpool, here at Goodison Park. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And we're fully convinced this game will live up to its billing. It's Everton, and they take on Western Sydney Wanderers. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And here's how Everton line up. Jordan Pickford is the keeper. James Tarkovsky plays alongside Yeri Mina in central defence. Alex Iwobi starts alongside Abdoulaye Dukure in central midfield. And leading the attack today is Dominic Calvert-Lewin. Showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. Of danger here as he runs at them. Can he do it? Oh, it was a crucial challenge. Ducure. Anthony Gordon. Mason Holgate with it. Calvert Lewin. It will be. It's with Ducure. McNeil. Well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. McNeil. Can they forge ahead? Tenacious tackling. Excellent defending there. Roma Amalfitano. We're getting the ball forward. He could pick out a teammate. And a significant block following that cross. It will be. Gordon. Covert Lewin. Well, the stats don't lie. Everton have had a lot of possession, but with the talent they have on show here, the lack of quality in the attacking third has been a real disappointment. They need to play with more urgency to win this one. That's right, and priority number one here is to win the ball back. Excellent defending. It will be. Plenty of options. Can he finish? And so there we have it. The first half has come to an end here at Goodison. Well, such is the lot of an attacking player. Someday... And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. Calvert-Lewin. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Milos Ninkovic. Good looking ball. Still passing it around with authority. Timely intervention. Ducure. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Very quick thinking there. Brandon Borello. Calvert Lewin. 
Moving the ball forward with purpose. He will be. Putting his body on the line. Xavier, Milos Ninkovic. Now well, they've lost it. And flag raised offside. Well, that was always going to be offside. He just needed to hold on to the ball that little bit longer. And time for the change now. Brandon Borello. Promising sequence. A good and fair challenge. Calvert Lewin has the strength to hang on to it. Anthony Gordon. And they're on the front foot, looking for a winner near the. Oh, a vital save. And it remains all even. Well, there you have it. He may just have saved his team here. Substitution time it is here. Short corner favourite. Alan. Now with Calvert Lewin. McNeil, and Ali's ready. A wonderful save to keep it level. That's a wonderful save. He was so alert there. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Playing it in. It comes to absolutely nothing. Deli Alley. Oh, surely. And a goal. This is why we adore this game. Late drama. And now they're in front. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. So back playing once more, and it's Everton with the lead. So two minutes of stoppage time here. And that is going to be that. Well, a tale of woe in terms of the scoreline as far as the visitors are concerned here. Well, I thought it was a really intense game. Lots of quality, lots of good individual displays. In the end, though, they won't be happy with the defeat, nor the manner of it, conceding so late on. What well, a good performance it was from Deli Ali. No two ways about that. What did you like about what you saw from him? Well, if anyone deserved to be the match winner, it was him. He played really well today, and what a big goal that was.